Who are you? Hi, I'm Peter. I'm the CTO of Metayo, and um, I'm showing you something we think is really cool. What we call real augmented reality experiences outdoors. It's the first time I've ever shot while the snow is going. We're in, uh, <laughs> we're in your offices in Munich, Germany, and that's a lot of fun. So what are, what are you showing me? Because this is not a cell phone, but it's a prototype of something. Yeah, coming. it's a prototype. Okay. First of all, who are you? I'm Gunnar. Hi, I'm technical pre-sales with Matayo. Yeah. Here in the headquarters, and there we're going to show you prototype of what's possible with future technology. Okay. And you guys do augmented reality, right? Yes. I've seen your stuff before. We we were in your San Francisco office and got to look at Lego kiosks that do all sorts of fun things. Yeah. yeah. So. And and I mean our job is basically you know, providing all kinds of augmented reality technology to anyone who wants to build something on top. And um, the Lego kiosk is one example, but we're also working to, uh, you know, take augmented reality browsing to a new level. So what is this going to do? This what is, am I going to see? Yeah, we're going to see, as an example, we're going to see a dragon attached to that building over there. Uh, and a virtual be, dragon. A virtual dragon. It will be crawling on that building and, right. and the, the cool thing about it is we, we will be walking towards this back and forth and it will always be crawling and at the same place and very accurately uh, registered. So, this gives, so uh, the iPad 2 is coming soon with camera, right? And so a kid could point his iPad or something like it at that building and, and see that. So that's what we're heading for, Exactly, toward, right? exactly. So okay. really to make outdoor AR gaming really become true fun because you can, you know, truly connect it to the to the real environment. All right. Yeah. So let's see let's see how this works. All right. Okay. All right. You let me get over here. Okay. Yeah. We we can, let's go over there. Because, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll just. So, what? So what are you loading up here? Oh, okay. So I'm just loading the scene. Okay. <laughs> ah. And so, what is this? What is it doing in, underneath? What's the computer code doing? Um, basically, uh, we we can work with existing models of of the real environment. Okay. Actually, this umbrella should be for him. Ah, yeah. <laughs> so, um, I mean, a lot of people are taking data of the real world, okay. not just Google Street View, but there's all kinds of companies like Earthmine and so on who are doing this kind of stuff. So, with okay. this kind of data, we can tell the, teach the computer a model of how the real world looks like. So you can initialize with your GPS position, say, oh, you're around here, and then you download that data, and then you suddenly snap in and become super accurate. Okay, yeah. so. So we see there's a dragon attached yep. to the wall. Start to sit a little bit, yep. All I can do, I can look around and stay there, and I can also just occlude it, yep. and it will come back. And now if you start moving back, that's the interesting part. <laughs> <laughs> yep. It's hard to see a little bit, but yeah. Yeah, it's okay? Yep. I turn off the brightness to the max. <laughs> so it's basically supposed to, you know, it's staying where it's supposed to stay. Yeah. Yep. Where, where we put it at the first place. In other words, it's, it's on the building and yeah. it's not, it's not uh, moving around. Yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. yeah. That's cool, and there's not a real one on the real building, <laughs> yeah, right? No. So it's not so a it's trick. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's a trick line. <laughs> we didn't put, put, put one of our guys up there to act like a dragon. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, you it's can, pretty even, stable. Yeah. Should we go back more? No, that's fine. Oh, okay. No, we can, that's let's fine. get closer. So, closer. Um, okay. yeah. So, um, um, what is so it has a 3D model of the building. You yeah. built yes. a 3D model then of the no, building. No, no, it does it automatically. We don't have to build it. Okay. We don't have to. No, see, the, the closer you get, yeah, then, it blinked. Uh, then it's really it blinked on and off. Sorry. Uh, yeah. Sometimes it, you know, it's losing it. But uh, these things, when you then combine it uh, with the gyro and everything, so when you know you can you can create a hybrid tracking system easily. Yeah. Uh, this is just the demo. Of you know, only visual, but of course you will combine it then with a smartphone, yeah. with all the existing sensors, yeah. and then have like a seamless, super realistic experience going on. So you could have games, like at South by Southwest, you could be having games, you point your camera at a building, like, uh, oh, 
if you go to the Salt Lake Barbecue, yeah. you could point at the front door of the Salt Lake Barbecue, and it could have some virtual scene there that, that you play with. Or yeah, yeah, I mean, if there's a new Spider-Man movie coming out, you could have Spider-Man run around South by Southwest, and you just hold up your phone and say, oh, wow, there's Spider-Man. Yeah. And he will be as realistic as in the movie. And, yeah. and this is what our goal is, you know, to, to really get there. And maybe in the future, when you, when you went to a movie and you really liked it, You say, oh man, I want to be in that movie. And then suddenly you, you download an app and you say, this is a Sherlock Holmes app. And yeah. suddenly you become Sherlock Holmes. You walk around your city and, and solve crimes, things like that. Now, is this an SDK that's going to be built into other iPhone apps? Or how are we going to see this come on market? Because right now it's a prototype that yeah. works yeah. here in Germany, but doesn't work very Yeah, and the PC is actually available already, okay. um, but on mobile it will come inside the SDK, but it will also become part of Junio Augmented yeah. Reality Browser. Very so, cool. Yeah. Well, cool. Let's get out of the snow. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Where do we learn more about this, by the way? Uh, sorry? Where do we learn more? Uh, we will put up some movies and, and uh, uh, there's uh, research papers, but maybe we should write a blog, blog okay. post about it or you. <laughs> All right, uh, and it's a Janio? It, or where, where would I, what website would I go to to learn more about it? Uh, the um, probably augmented blog. Augmented yeah, blog, yeah. okay. And are you guys on Twitter? Yes. It's what's your uh, Twitter address? It's twitar. Twitar, and what Twit about you? Under AR. Okay. Uh, I'm uh, AR Peter. AR Peter, and how about you? I don't have Twitter. You don't have Twitter? <laughs> oh, loser. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> All right. Well, cool. All right. thank you very much. You're welcome. Thanks.